Hello and welcome to my Project 3 presentation for Software Development for Real-Time Embedded Systems. For this project, we'll be working on measuring and transmitting fan speed and thrust. So in this project, we have a small circuit. It includes an IR LED, a phototransistor, a resistor, a bunch of wires, and our propeller that we're going to be measuring the RPM for. So in this case, this motor is controlled by this ESC, ESC that goes through into the Arduino board. So what's going to happen is that whenever there's an interference in this path, there's going to be a trigger for an RPM. And in our code base, we measure the RPM every time we go through it. So I'm going to start the program. So for this propeller, we notice that the, the power between 0 and 35 does not actually generate anything to cause issues in the system. So this is going to not do anything for about 16 seconds. Once it's ready, it'll start propelling and it'll go up to a speed of 50. This is very fast. Currently nothing is being measured. So you'll see 0 and this thing is very fast. Okay. So on the next time this goes through, I'm going to put it in between this system and we're going to measure the RPM. Um, the speed goes down periodically, it's about, the whole time goes, it takes about 50 seconds to go through the whole system from 0 to 50 and back down. Um, we're going to measure the RPM after this point. So as this gets ready, I'm going to do it and we're going to start seeing some speed go up. So. We're going to measure it. We'll start shortly. So we are currently going between the R LED and photo transistor, and the speed is going up, and then it will slowly come back down over time. So as you see, if you look closer to the monitor, the RPM is, has gone up to about 4,000, and now is increasingly decreasing until it goes down to zero. And this is done periodically, and you'll be able to see it working. So what happens is over time, I've already recorded the results of this, and so over time it'll look like this graph, where after about 16 seconds, it'll increase to up to 4,000 RPM, and slowly decrease shortly before it restarts its period and does it again. So that is my presentation for Project 3. Thank you.